What's the word, everybody? It's your boy Jay Sites, and I'm back with another tutorial. And today, I'm about to show y'all how to make this logo spin on this BMW car. You want to grab your footage and let's duplicate that. All right, and we're gonna name this layer a logo. All right, so let's double click that logo and let's come to the rotoscope tool and let's just gather the whites and the blues of this BMW logo. Okay, so once you have your roto finished, we're gonna hit this tool right here, the pan behind tool, the anchor pool. And we're gonna press A on your keyboard real quick and let's drag this little anchor point over to the middle of the actual uh, logo here. Let's hit the stopwatch on anchor point. And let's keep that anchor point in the middle of your logo see if you had your camera on a tripod or let's say you had a moving object and your camera was stuck to that object then you wouldn't have to do this step but yeah my camera I was zooming out on my zoom lens so I have to do this once you have that finished you can come back to your rotation settings by hitting R on the keyboard and hitting the stopwatch on the first frame come to your last frame you want to change this to around eight you know something cool let's highlight both of those keyframes hit f9 to easy ease and let's open up the waveform and let's just drag this top one down or we can drag the we can drag the first one up and then drag the last one back up as well depending on how you feel oh yeah and on your last keyframe make sure the second set of numbers after the X is set to zero so you have an automatic uh, you know it automatically goes back to what you had it when you first uh, started the effect once you have that spinning you want to enable the motion blur we're gonna up the scale, maybe to 120, 130, something cool like that. And then uh, let's duplicate that first layer again, bring it to the top above your logo, and then let's create a simple mask. Okay, so once you have that mask, you wanna hit M, and you wanna right click the, ma the track mask, and then press play. And now you want to open up your mask, change it from add to subtract. Change the feathering to about 70 or 80%. As well as the expansion. Add RS and B to complement this effect. As always, RS and B is just like, ugh. It's like a girl that don't cheat. Lovely. And now that you have that, be straight, man. This is another quick effect, real quick, from Jay Sites. Nah, but um, if you enjoyed this, drop a like, drop a comment, subscribe. I got a brand new pack on the way, and everything, man. I'm just doing everything one at a time. I'm dropping music videos here. I'm dropping tutorials here. Just stay tuned with me, man. Consistency is key. That's why I keep coming back to you guys every month. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, stay tuned for the next set of tutorials and, uh, yeah, enjoy. Thank you. I just made it time.